The Sabanja Museum is challenging visitors to take responsibility in humankind's relationship with nature. And it does it through the Living Pyramid by eco-artist Agnes Dinis. Her manifesto, which was read by author Buket Uzuner at the exhibit's lounge, is all about educating people on how we really don't have any power over nature. And the solution is to work together, to preserve it rather than destroy it. The pyramid is the embodiment of this philosophy. It's made of wood, and each of its levels are filled with different plants. Since the exhibition is being held in Istanbul, the flowers and greens on the art piece are native to the city, and they're expected to grow as seasons change. For the director of the museum, the exhibit is a timely warning call. Agnes Deans isn't ahead of her time artist, but it's only now when we have reached the peak of climate change dangers, like wildfires and high temperatures, that people understand her importance. But even now, we don't always pay attention to nature's warning signs, so we had to have such an exhibition that makes a statement about the subject. Bukit Zuzuner is no stranger to themes of nature and was already a subscriber to Dinis's ideals. When I was reading the, uh, the items that she was defending and standing, strongly behind, I realized that what she was saying in 1969, even that time, as a woman, because women's voices are not uh, heard as strong as men anywhere in the world, uh, I, I really uh, loved her ideas and her strength, and also the, the, uh, the living pyramid is something really very special and as an, as an artist, that, uh, to combine the, the artistic ideas and ecology and the, the truth, actually, behind the human life. And they all were together, and the, 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 the shape of pyramid also has a very historical depth. So um, even I was very busy uh, completing my new novel called Fire, but, uh, and I'm not an early bird, <laughs> and I live on the Asian side of Istanbul, but I'm happy that I am here, and I read, uh, it was an honor for me. And Dinis's ideals will also reach future generations through the Pyramid of Life. After the exhibit runs its course, the wood housing of the plants will be recycled for the use of children to keep the environmentalist spirit alive. Alijan Pamir, TRT World, Istanbul.